Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Hope you are doing well. This week, a small update. As you guys know, I recently moved towards a new property. Always a scary time moving your birds. So fortunately, I could move my whole aviary to a new location and the timing in terms of weather was perfect. So all the birds could go inside the aviary. The timing in terms of molding phase of the golden finches was not so perfect. Time for an update to see how all the birds are doing a couple of weeks after the move. It's never wise to move your birds during the molding phase, but I had no choice. But fortunately, they continued their mold and they look fantastic again. Also the chicks have almost completely finished their mold. Now we can see their gender and head colors. We have one female, a red hat and five males. Four black hats and one red hat. It's cool to see that both nests had one red hat even though one pair both had black hats. All birds are also split for a white breast, so pretty amazing. And now you're probably missing one little bird, the parrot finch chick raised by the society finches. She, yes, it's a girl, is keeping me company during the edit of this video. She has a new companion. They will stay here until the bird gallery is done. Her mate is the parrot finch male that didn't have a click with my female. I've kept him in the bird gallery last year because I wanted the second pair of this wonderful species. So lucky our little chick is a female, so if the bird gallery is ready, I have an extra pair and hopefully she will get some chicks for her own. And that's not all. I also gave the birds their nest boxes and some coconut fiber. I was very curious to see if they were settled by now and ready to start building a new nest already. I have some boxes in the outdoor part and in the indoor part of the aviary. Multiple species started nest building immediately. The mannequins were interested in a nest box in the indoor area and the society finches quickly made a nest in the outdoor part. But the coolest nest I found was not in a nest box, but inside the bushes. So I immediately went inside to take a closer look. The owl finches made an awesome nest. I got a handy little mirror from my father-in-law to see if I maybe already have the first eggs. As you could see, three little eggs. It will be difficult to check or ring the chicks, but I think it's pretty awesome to see how well built this nest is and to see the natural way of breeding. But the owl finches are not the only ones with eggs. Also, the button quills have four eggs. She takes advantage of all the coconut fibers which are dropped by the owl finches building their nest above. She built a nice little nest in the corner of the aviary and as you can see the male is also curious about how she and the eggs are doing. Although he's not always happy. She isn't around anymore and starts calling for her or other quills.
Let's hope the other birds will also start a nest with eggs soon. For now, I'm working hard on the bird gallery when I have the time. More on that on an upcoming video, so stay tuned. That's it for now. Smash that like button and if you don't want to miss any of my upcoming videos, press that subscribe button and hit the bell to get notified if I upload again. It's free and it also helps out this channel a lot. For now, remember to stay happy and always love your birds. Bye bye!